it's not easy being sleazy. So we did a thing. Did we tell you? We only need the two of us together. I need only you in this crazy world. Cause we got love, love. I need only you here with me. You wanna get close to me? Why don't you do it right now? Good morning. It is Thursday, May 28th, right? May 28th. I'm making pancakes. These are almond pancakes from Sweet as Honey. And here, I don't know, you probably won't be able to see, but that is the recipe, probably backwards, but making those for Arlo because she wants a McGriddle. So we're going to make that happen. I'm looking for coconut, oh here, coconut oil. Got some coconut oil here. Butter, so it calls for eggs. Um, almond milk, which I'm gonna use coconut milk. Am I clear? Coconut milk, um, coconut oil, almond flour, baking soda, and then top it however you like. So that's what I'm doing right now. And I'm making it in the Ninja. Anyway. Not that nice of a day today. I mean, the sun is kind of like in and out, but it looks like it's going to start raining. Anyway, let me get going. So Arlo already ate one, <laughs> and I forgot to show you when they were actually both done. But that's what it looks like. She loves it, and she uses that sugar-free syrup. That's our favorite. We get that from Walmart, just in case you were interested. Good afternoon. Today is Friday, May 29th. Wow, I'm surprised that I actually got that out. Okay, so it is 5.32, we just made dinner. Today is Omed. Why? Because we had a whole bunch of stuff that we needed to do today. And explain what Omed is, because some people might not Okay, know. Omed, one meal a day. Or is it one meal a day? One Whatever meal it is. A day. Anyway, here's our food. So here's our dinner. It's um, shrimp scampi with miracle noodle fettuccine shaped two burgers with cheese on top, and I'm having a bang. Ooh, <clears throat> peach mango flavored. I was banging into her bush. Asshole. Anyway, um, so we are having trouble getting out of the driveway because two cars in the driveway is not easy. And then this overgrown bush. Yeah, we have an overgrown bush. So I wanted to tell you guys something, but it's not easy being sleazy. Okay, here we go. So we did a thing. We what brought Weezy in the car. We, we brought Chloe in the car with us. That wasn't the thing we did though. But did we tell you? No. We didn't tell them anything. We have been MIA for a day and a half. Months, but it's it's more like a day and a half. I know, but kind of like years, a year and a half. I know, but we've been vlogging for the last couple of weeks, like two weeks. Anyway, we did a thing today, and the thing we did was we bought a house. <laughs> and so that that happened today. Yeah. Maybe we can insert the uh, Instagram clip. We'll put them here, if I remember. Insert Instagram clip. How excited are you? I'm not very excited. She's crazy. I, I, oh I'm my God! I'm excited on the inside. Stop with that shit. Scream! Ah! We got keys to our new home. That's the reminder. We're bringing Chloe over. The kids already seen it. We brought the kids over as soon as we got home from the closing. We, my mom went to go see it. Uh, for all you guys that are wondering, my mom, uh, my parents are very happy for us. Um, Chloe has no idea where she's going. Well, she knows that she's excited because she's, she's in the car. And we're excited. Like, we were screaming before. It's not that it's worn off because it hasn't. No. But it's. You guys already know, we've been through the ringer, man. We've been through the ringer in the last couple of years and this is really something that we needed. We needed this pick-me-up and 
we got it. So, we are gonna give you a house tour so that you can see it, an empty house tour, so that you can see our new home. I hope you're ready. And the things that we're gonna do to it. Yes, we're gonna do lots of things. door Chloe's freaking the fuck out we have a bathroom here this is actually our bathroom I'll show you in a minute this is the entryway we have a coat closet here but we are not going to use it as a coat closet and then a window here and the kitchen over there okay so we're going to do this first there you go it's got a lot of counter space a big shower another window and then a really big closet that we can put all our toiletries in. We've got the toilet over there. And then big, big mirror, which I'm very excited for. And then I'm not really gonna be able to show you this because there's no lights in here, but this is our bedroom. We've got two windows. And then that's my closet. That's Arlo's closet. We both have a closet of our own, which is friggin' awesome. So that's our bedroom, which this is the bathroom, and we are the only ones that are gonna use this bathroom. So then you make a turn, and then this is the living room. It has vaulted ceilings, which is freaking awesome. And this house is full of windows, okay? This is the door for outside. This is, that's supposed to be a formal dining room. We're not using it as that. You'll see what we do with it. You back up, there's the kitchen stairs to the kids rooms there's like a little loft area which is freaking awesome and then here's our yard we need a lot of help in the back we need a fence and a good cleanup a once one time cleanup and then we'll keep up with it after that and then over here this is where we're going to be like an office slash that we'll put the guinea pigs in here there'll be like a, maybe a little futon or something in here for like when guests come over we have plans on putting like those barn door tracks just to make it more private. And then here's the kitchen where Arlo's at. Dun -dun. There's a lot of space in this kitchen, so we have plans. None of that is staying the color that it is. Laundry area. And then this is the garage. And then I'll show you guys upstairs. Dog's freaking the fuck out. She has no idea where she's at. And then up we go, the kids' rooms are up here. I'm probably not going to be able to see too good because it's getting dark. So, here's Austin's room. There it is. He's got a really big closet. The kids have really big closets. Nice window. And then there's like a little area here we're going to put... First, there's another window. An area here we're going to put like a little seating area, which is going to be cool. This is the kids' bathroom and also the guest bathroom. So, is there a light here? Oh, yes. Whoop, here it is. Here we go. This is the kids' bathroom. It's pretty damn cool. They've got a nice big mirror, nice vanity. The fucking dog is freaking out. And then over here is Sammy's room. Her room's a little bigger than Austin's because, I mean, she's a girl. She's got a lot of crap. But I'm totally, whoops, clear up, clear up. Oh, there we go. And then this is her closet. She has a big closet as well. And then you can look over, which is so cool, at the whole living room area. So we are so excited. Look at all these windows. There's windows everywhere. But we are so excited for this, like seriously excited. We're probably gonna come tomorrow if it's not pouring and take some pictures in front of the house for us. Another window, look at this. Isn't it crazy? Windows everywhere. And then here's a closer look at the kitchen. We are gonna be painting the cabinets, doing something different with the counter, changing the floor. 
There's another window. <laughs> so exciting. Oh, say hi. Hi. She's doing measurements. So the stove, I mean, it's like an older looking stove, but it works perfectly fine. So I'm not changing anything. We have to buy a fridge, but that's it. Like this is super exciting for us. We are so stoked to have our own place. Anyway, we'll talk to you when we get home. Good morning. Today is um, Sunday, May 31st. I know Dana has already started vlogging, but didn't I just say that? Anyway, I was trying to fuck around with my sideburns because they were like down here and they were like really fucking bushy. I don't know if I have a picture. Maybe I can put it right here. So, this has been in the package for a while, so I was fucking around with it. Then it was like, you look weird. Let me just cut your hair. So, mm -hmm. I think we're just going to fucking bite the belly and get that done. Pray for me. Please. Okay, I know I look different only because I showered. <laughs> You're stupid. As stressful as it was for not only me, but just me, not Dana. I'm just kidding. She was like, oh my God, what do you have me to do now? And how am I gonna, and Arlo, stop it. I feel like a new woman. It, it just. It looks way better, man. It, it does. I feel better. Um, I don't know, can you see it? It looks better. It just looks better. I feel so much better. I think Dana's gonna let me cut her hair too. I'm not quite sure yet. I mean, she says it now, but you never know. Her mind changes like the wind. And um, maybe, maybe not. Maybe you'll see it, maybe you won't. You know how we are. Anyway, um, I came out of the shower and I've got breakfast ready. It's just some uh, basic. Scrambled eggs with some feta and then Vienna sausages. Dana's got an omelet coming out of the microwave because apparently it wasn't all that cooked. Hold on. Let's see. Where is it? Turkey and cheese omelet. Ah, there it is. Simple. What's in the green? Oh, that's just green onion. Ah, there you go. We're going to enjoy. Okay, so we are in the new house. And we're just, we had to bring a couple of things over. Just some stuff that we bought. Some stuff we bought from Walmart, some things we bought from Target, and uh, are those doing some measurements because we're going to put a microwave over the stove because right now it has a hood and our it's an old. Our plans are to do that. Does Arlo not know how, much, how to do it? I'll figure it out. There, so there you go. So this is like an older, obviously very old, um, like hood. So we're going to get that out of here because it really is just not doing anybody any good. The fan, it's like doing that. Like that's how turn it moves. Turn it on high. Do it. You hear that? No. Exactly, because it's barely on. So that's gonna come out. She's, we're gonna get a, you know, a microwave there because um, if you get another, like if you just get a like a, a counter countertop microwave, it's going to take up our countertop. So we don't, we're, we're trying for that not to happen because we want to utilize all of the space we have. Um, but so that's a plan there. So she measured all of that, and then we went around to kind of like some of the windows. I went to actually all of the windows and seen which windows had screens, which ones didn't. So. It's like, it's like every, I don't know if you can, there we go. It's like every other window has a screen, which is odd, but whatever. So we'll need screens. So she's gonna measure. They pretty much all look about the same, these ones down here. I don't know about the kids and the hallway upstairs, but our windows in our room both have screens and they're pretty decent screens. They're not like jacked up. So they seem fine. Yeah, and uh, trying to figure out how we would put our bed in here. I'm thinking up against this wall here with the TV straight ahead because that seems logical. This way, there's a window here and there's a window there and no windows are being covered. And you can get the cross breeze and all that. So, that's it. That's that. Looking in the closet, it'd be nice to have a regular ass closet because I don't have one now. I have to share a closet with Sammy, so yeah. 
And then, Arla, you wanted to take measurements of the, so we can put a shower curtain in here? Oh, yeah. Yeah. The kids is probably just standard. But, um, yeah, so that's, that's what's happening here. I'm going to take this out. It's not doing anything for anybody. Um... Anyway, so like, yeah, we, we got some, I don't know, can you see that? There we go. We got some towels and stuff. That's the color theme we're going for the kids' uh, bathroom. Obviously, you will see it in the before and afters once I put everything up, wash everything, clean everything, all that jazz. So, yeah, that's that. I mean, yeah, I mean, there's nothing really, we're not going to be here very long because it's really a nice day and there's really nothing we could do right now. Because our first priority is, number one, we gotta put screens in. So now that we know we have to do that, we gotta get screens. Number two, the landscaping of the property and a fence. Once that's done, we can worry about what we're doing with the kitchen. And then pretty much it's just a really big cleanup and that's it, which is cool. So I mean, that's all folks. That's all that's happening here. I'm very, I'm very excited. You know what? I didn't I didn't ring the doorbell. Let's see what it sounds like. You guys will be hearing it for the first time too. Alright, you ready? One, two. <gasps> there it is. <laughs> oh, so let me just show you guys. Hold on. So obviously the pollen is crazy here in Jersey right now. I'm sure it's the same everywhere, but Look at our cute little porchy porch that we can have our coffee with. With? In. On. Jeez. So, yeah. So cool. I'm so excited for it. And then we realized that because we came and visited the house in the winter-ish, we didn't know this hole came up. So that's pretty cool, right? We've got like hostas and kinds of plants growing. So that's exciting. Anywho, so yeah, that's our porch.